bow, right hand, if you, if they explain you why we chop bow like this? No. You know, why, why not uh, like this? Why not like this? This is Shaolin. Shaolin and Wang. I'm Buddhist as well. So Shaolin will bow like this, right? And from Shaolin, we are fighting. Now, for the Wing Chun Street Fight, Street Fight, Southern style, the right hand represents power and knowledge. Left hand pull, meaning this is not hard for, you know, a little bit in the neighbor trying to fight, this and that, this is hard for yourself. Protect your family, protect yourself. Uh, then, if we learn to respect the art, we're not selling the art, not a bad guy, not get high by somebody to kill somebody, so that's the respect for you, right? So, right hand, left hand over and over. When you bow, okay, you're not in karate, they know they're very respectful in the inside the dojo. You need to respect like this. Right. Now the art of Wing Chun and here is a street fight. So when you go on the ring and you bow with your opponent, this and that, you always look up with the other. Just in case the guy tries to do it. Yeah. Right? So then from that position, kind of, Right? So the form starts in form that. Okay? That's the bow. Alright? Now we start slowly put the silum down. Start the head move straight. Alright. Relax and elbow pull. Now when you do the elbow, pull back here in the form. Good. What you okay, what you are thinking is somebody have your hand up here, right? Hold it up. Okay, hand up. Alright, hand out. Take my hand out. Wrap my hand. So here people wrap your hand. You never pull this way. Hold it up. You don't pull this way. You drop the elbow over here. Instead of pull straight, you drop the elbow. And then you lose elbow pull. Hold it here. You see that moving chopping. Yeah, hold it, hold it. Yeah. I will do that. Then please all fine. Great. You don't pull like this. Ah, because you don't like this. Hold it here. Hold it on. You show the fight. Right. right. Yeah. Yes? Why you soft? If you run your elbow, hold it on. You soft turn elbow. Now you got a body. Right. And because of that, the body pull is very strong. Now you make the guy fall forward to you. Then your hand will hit. So the form is up from here, the last elbow. Is that right? Don't hold your wrist hard. Okay. So that's the difference from take one to karate. When you hold your wrist hard, they are they are make the technique less effective. Because when the guy wrap my head hard, pull it hard, and I hold it hard, I pull back, pull it hard. It's fine. You see it? And because my force here and your force there. Right? With the wind chunk, and when you hold it hard, pull it hard, and I soft. Is that different? Is that different? Is that different? Because now the song make my hip pull you in. Now we get that punch. That's why the form from here, the last, only hit the elbow. Now that. From that moment, when you open your V, you can jump back. It is the step. V, turn your heel, settle your balance. When you're in the balance of Wing Chun, this is when you are jumping. Uh, Picture yourself, you jump on the boat in the bottom. That's it, it's not whole stiff. It's not like that, it's sinking in the bottom. You create a triangle shape. Yes? Now what the triangle shape meaning, okay, hold it right here. What you want to do, if you're thinking of, do not on both feet, you are back and bottom. What you prepare is, put the hand up right here. You prepare if a people come and they Okay, I, if I hold it straight, and the guy pull me, they pull me, I will fall forward to him, right? Because I like this. So I'm normally, I lean back a little, so they pull, yeah, pull it hard, pull it hard. Step back and pull. Number one, you want that, so you can move forward, hit rather than you fall forward. Right. So that's why I lean back a little. How about push, 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 push. Yeah, push the body, push the body. This thing made me to go, yeah. Push the body, push the body, the hand. Ah, so I'm bothered with that triangle when I'm in forward push. Right. I'm not like this. Alright? So you do the form watching, not stand still, and the guy who does, we're gonna fly. You want to do like a triangle. You understand that? That's the step. Right. So here, that's the step. Hand right here. From here, you start having double that so. You double that so. Hand not touching. Good. Hand not touching. The force comes from the elbow. The force comes from the elbow. Perfect. The one you place the hand right here, the purpose is, again, the difference with the art of art, they thought similar with this moment in karate. No, we don't do that. We always put this in the elbow. This is the last. We don't block it. What you do is you try to go elbow down and hold like this. Feel it now? And my hand relaxes. So I hold you like this. All right? So this move in karate is this, meaning take the kick to your arm here. Yeah. Yes. Wing Chun just 
relax, place your elbow. So when you do this move, it place your elbow down. Right. What you try to do is, for example, okay, the hand hit, and I'm walking. You see that the reason why you see my hand hit? Relax. Yeah? If you fall in, you see that. Yeah? But because I'm relaxed, I have my right option. Right. Yeah? If I'm relaxed, you got a hand coming? On the other I have that speed. If I go like this, right, I hold it there, I hit, but that hand coming, I have a jump. So this form is not of, of a wrist force, it is elbow and hip. How's that? From that moment, turn angle. So you see, let's say you see sitting down online, most people do just turn like this. Simple word. Same thing you see. Now the real one and flip it inward. Then push. Yeah, so first left outside, flip inward. Move forward. Okay, then elbow out. Got again. Elbow out, flip inward to the body. Engage the line of force. 
meaning when I hand right here, yes, I move this way, I use my elbow motion. I didn't do this, something. Yes, that wrong. Go from hip, engage. What happened if somebody grabbed my hand right at this moment and I'm weaker than that person, I can slide, or not, I still can use my elbow to run touch it. Which I need to form like this. How do I do this way when we stop? I can use my elbow to get a punch. Does that make sense? So the way we do is slide the elbow to the middle, form the elbow. Yes, 